Hey you guys, welcome back to our channel. So um, we're in mom's bedroom. I've got a quite a few little things going on in here. And uh, we're gonna spend a few minutes. It's 9.15 at night, I've not eaten dinner. Um, I just got some unexpected news that I didn't expect. And um, I am going to clean my way through it, if that makes any sense. I am going to force myself into Mm, cleaning mode right now because it's the only way I can deal and that's perfectly fine I'm not um, it's, I'm, I'll, it's all gonna be well there's no other way for it to be but um in order for me to deal I need to clean something and that is a coping mechanism it's a, a, a coping strategy that I have and so I am going to clean something um, with that being said, we thought you guys might want to come along. I'm going to show you the wreck that is my bedroom. Alrighty, you guys. So I've been doing a lot of filming of, of some videos that are coming out. And this is the holding place for all of the things, right? I've got bags over here. Y'all have been to the Goodwill. And I'm filming. And I haven't been able to get... I've still got pictures to make with these. So I haven't put those up yet. I haven't washed them either because I haven't done the pictures. I've got to get the pictures done because if I wash them, they may shrink. So I'm going to do the pictures really quick and then I'm going to wash everything. This stuff over here is all washed and some of those came out of Alana's room. She graced me with giving me my stuff back, bless the Lord. So that just needs to be put up. Um, the main thing that I've got to control is actually in here. That. So here is my issue. This is my issue, or the main issue is my shoes. My shoes are out of control, and then my purses are out of control in my bags. So I've got to maintain some semblance of order. And then I also have shoes or booties up there, and then a whole rack of shoes right here. So I've got to get rid of some stuff so that I can make room. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull everything out here and I'm going to put that new shoe rack. It's, it's not a new shoe rack. It was in Jackson's. Um, sorry, y'all looking at the toilet, but it was in Jackson's room holding his shoes. And I bought a new one, but I don't like it for my shoes. The one I wanted um, cost a little bit more than what I was willing to spend. So I got one that would work for him and his shoes. Sorry, I was checking uh, a Facebook thing, but it's fine. That, that's nothing. I got to work, y'all. I got to work. Okay. Y'all pray for me. Um, yeah. Anyway, I got to, um, I got to work. Work is going to help me not to uh, break down. Work is going to help me to focus. Work is going to help me to manage my way through some of what I just got off the phone and, and had to deal with and will have to deal with in the next little bit. So um, all is well. My family is all is well. My immediate family, my kids, myself, my ex-husband, you know, I count him in the immediate family because of the kids. But we're all we're all good. Um, this was extended family, but it was still family. And um, I got to work. So I'm going to put you guys up on a tripod and then I'm going to start decluttering in that closet because it has to happen. Okay, you guys. So I am stopping my, I'm, pop, I'm, com, I'm popping in during my closet clean out to share with you the goodness, right? So in my last grocery haul, I told you guys that I could not find any markdown meats, but I just so happened to be at Food Lion and they had these two trays of pork steak, uh, Boston butt steaks uh, marked down. One is for $10 and one is for $9. So I would never normally pay that price, but those were the cheapest ones. So I picked up two of those. We're gonna eat one for dinner tonight, one will go in the freezer. And then, lucky of luck, right? Because when I went to Harris Teeter to, to look for the chickens that were 99 cents a pound, they had two chickens. One was $16 and one was $20 for a chicken that looked just like this. 
but I actually ran up on this one for $4.57. This one is $5.96. And then we got another one for uh, $5.83. And I did leave a couple for somebody else. But anytime I see something, I'm going to pick it up. And so that's what I found. I needed to get some coconut milk that I forgot and some baby corn. We're gonna make some um, keto cornbread. We only use like a little bit of this. We don't use the whole thing. Um, and then we'll maybe make some chowder because I can put some of that in some chowder. Um, and that's gonna be, we use the recipe from the Southern Keto Cookbook, but we also, we just add this in and that came from that Keto Ladies um, Cookbook. But I got some coconut milk. We're gonna try to use as much coconut milk as we can in place of cream. And then, of course, I got some zero uh, sugar um, coffee creamer and Carb Smart ice cream. So that's what we got. Just wanted to share that with you guys very quick. But I'm a. Um, Do you mind your bowl? Okay. Don't mind me. Doesn't matter. I just got to get this bed changed. Okay, you guys, this is just turning into a regular vlog, right? So we went to a place called the um, Fairy Circle. They had a dollar sidewalk sale. And I've been doing some fashion blogging, uh, mm, vlogging, vlog kind of whatever you want to call it. Just looking and trying to update my look. So this is a man's Ralph Lauren chap shirt. It's a large. Um, but I, I've seen this. I've seen women style this. So I picked this up to go kind of in the chambray um, scheme. It's not official chambray, but, you know, I couldn't find a light chambray shirt. So I, I picked this one up. That was a dollar. And then I found these jeans. They're like uh, mid-rise, not high waist, 
but mid-rise. They're wide leg, and um, they'll probably come right down to my ankle. They were a dollar. I didn't try these on. I need to try these on. These were a size 16, and the reason I got a 16 instead of a 14 is because sometimes in... Um, in um, brands I'm not familiar with, and I couldn't try this on. I just got a extra. I just got a size up just to make sure it was only a dollar. So if it doesn't work, I didn't lose anything but a dollar. Um, then Alana picked her up a couple shirts that she liked. This was just a white. She likes detailing. She likes this detailing here at the bottom. Probably need to bleach that a little bit. And then I picked up this other men's shirt, the stripes. This is a Burdines. I think it is a, I don't remember the size, sizing, don't remember. But I picked this one up to style as well. We only spent like $5. I think there's one piece missing. So that's what we got in that little mini haul to throw all that in the wash. I am trying to clean out this area that had all of that foolishness in it since I've been doing the um the fall lookbook. So I'm trying to get this area cleaned out. I still have this bag. That's all of my Cairo stuff. And then I have this bag right here. Those pieces have not been photoed yet. So that's why they're still in the bag. Once they get photoed, they will then go to the uh, laundry. All right, you guys, so I'm just realizing now, days and days and days, weeks later, that I didn't finish. Um, I finished my closet in my main closet and the shoes in the shoe closet. I did not finish the purses. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to just film a separate video for that. There's been a lot of things that's going on, and you're probably going to see this video out of order. I mean, it probably will be out of order. Because I just did a video. I may have to try to remember. <laughs> I have to try to remember which one to put first. So I do apologize if this video comes out of order. But I did not have a chance to finish the bottom. I really am avoiding it, honestly. Um, there's some things I need to put on eBay for sale that I just haven't done. And then, honestly, just some culling I need to do, which is just getting some things out. But I was just looking at my skin and I just wanted to make a comment that my skin looks, I don't think my skin has ever looked this good. Now, when I'm looking at it, there's no filter on the camera, no anything. Um, sometimes in, in pictures, it looks, you know, like skin. But to me, I seem to be glowing and I don't understand that. But I'm eating well. Um, I feel good. I feel fine. Um, and life is just, it's good right now, all the time. Life is good every day. Let me just get my life together in Jesus' name. Um, I live a very blessed life. I'm still here. And somebody else is not. So, you know, I'm very thankful for that, honestly, in Jesus' name, to, um, be as blessed as I am to be alive you know there's so many reasons that that might not or should not be a testimony but i'm thankful but anyway that was all to say that my skin looks nice we're working with alana she's got some acne places that just don't love her and i'm doing the same you know i'm trying to get her to understand skin care and stuff like that shamika had bad acne breakouts too and then I'm trying to get Jackson to not be in that place because he is 12 and um, probably about to go through puberty. He has underarm stank. That's probably pubescent. It's too much. Um, not since I got him, though, because I don't have time for this. I do not have time for people to smell bad. Not around me, period, the end. Um, so, anywho... Yeah, I didn't have time to film that. So I'm just going to film it separately so I can get this part of the video, this video up. And I'll just do a separate video on that bottom part. My voice is different. Uh, seasons are changing. Um, so it goes through this every single season. And I'm getting my teeth done today. And I have not had any water or anything. 
since 10.30 last night. I ate something about four yesterday. And then I had three little steak bites. Ended up having to do sister's hair last night. And no time for food because I knew it was going to be, you know, don't eat after a certain amount of time. So I haven't eaten. I had three little steak bites. like, And I gave half of one. No, I gave half of two of them to ma'am. So that doesn't count. It's about 1030 last night. So anywho, hadn't eaten nothing. Really wish I could have coffee, but I'm all refrain because I know that's not a part of the plan of God's for me, for my life right now. Anywho, I'm setting up a video so that can go live and I'm trying to clear out my, my videos. I'm trying to clear out my queue or my cache of videos that I have just sitting there. So that's why I'm ending this and not finishing it. Um, but there's a lot of good stuff on this video and I'll just do the other part at another time. So anywho, thank you guys so much for stopping by. If you like the video, thumb it up. Don't forget to subscribe and we'll see you next time. Bye now.